Hello and welcome to an uh, episode where I just kind of experiment and try to figure out how the game works for humankind. And now, let's head into the episode. Hello! We interrupt your regularly scheduled playthrough of humankind um, for this experimentation video. Uh, this may pop up in the middle of the playthrough. It may not. Uh, I haven't decided yet. I feel like I'm getting my ass kicked so badly, essentially, in the base game that we have started. And we have, I don't know, maybe six hours in, which is hardly anything. That I want to do some experimenting. So, in this particular recording session, and for those of you watching live, hello to everyone watching live. Uh, including <laughs> IBAF, love the name, by the way. Um, we're going to actually experiment with, we'll say, the first probably 50 turns or so. So it's going to be many, many restarts, because I have some questions. So one of my questions was, my profile. All right, I can do this. Great. Main menu. It's AI personas and avatars. But this is ch save change editors. Again, this is save changes. Oh, we have unlocked some trophies. So, 500 gets you strength. Three cultural wonders get you strength. Strength, that's neat. But I was hoping you could create... Like, if I click new game, I'm gonna let things load in. Like, I was hoping you could create and save your own personas, I guess, for this. The AI persona. Um, just because, like I said, this says advanced. What that tells me is, once I am an advanced player, this will provide a challenge. I'm not an advanced player. This is what this tells me is this AI is going to kick my ass because I am not an advanced player. Um, where's another one? I am definitely not an expert player. Again, this tells me I want to use this AI on expert settings because if I don't, it will kick my ass. And then Ancestors Advanced. Oh, and Boudicca's Advanced. Oh, are these randomized? Um, there are some normal ones. Uh, so if we go into AR Persona, like, th like I should be able to hover over the advanced, expert, that sort of thing. So advanced, advanced, advanced. I don't want to play against those. Advanced, normal, I want to play against Elisa. Expert, no. Advanced, expert, no, 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 no. Oh, no, two. Two? That's it? Two normal AIs. And all of this. Here, Boudica, you're becoming Elisa. So it's like, well, wait a minute. I I don't want to play against... I want to play against normal AIs. So I learn the game and have a chance. I don't want... So that's a ding against the game right there. That seems weird. A uh, world... This is fine. World shape, climate. Yep. Nor world, new worlds, hemispheres, both. Oh, northern, southern. Oh, well, that's neat. Uh, random. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I like you how you can adjust all this. Pace. Okay. So, other than changing turns, like, does this affect income? Does this affect science? Tech rate? What does this affect? Like, great. I have 75 turns maximum. I would assume that means as opposed to 300 turns, because it's 75 turns, the rate at which you can do research, accrue resources, and all that jazz is increased by... I don't know, four times the speed. Does this slow it down? It, are, are things, are the, like the amount of, is your research speed cut in half? And that's what we're gonna try to explore today. 
Um, end conditions. This we can't do. So, again, default is... One of the following conditions is breached. Okay. Okay, so this ends the game, not victory points. Gotcha. All right. Because that's thing online, people have been saying the only way to win is by fame. Whoever has the most fame at the end of the game, no matter what else you do, that is who wins. Um. Oh, that's a neat one. Earning every contemporary era star. So theoretically, if I learned earned every star in the Neolithic Age before someone could jump to the next age, I would trigger the end of the game. That's funny. Um, vastly, you know, so, so, I don't know how this works. It's not, it, it specifically says this game will end, not the winner is chosen, uh, this is the win condition. This just triggers the end of the game. Okay. So, if my only goal is to recruit as much fame as possible, and the easiest way to accrue front fame is to go mass science or mass building, really. It, well, it, actually, fame seems pretty balanced. I'm just screwing it up horribly, and I don't know how it works. So that's the other thing. And then the difficulty. Okay, Metropolis is base. All right, so if I click nation, what bonuses does the AI get? Do they get fame bonuses? Do they get bonuses to stability? If I click Hamlet, what bonuses do I get? Do I get a bonus to stability? That that should all be moused over. Like, I just, that. Um, but we're just going to keep everything our normal. Um, and we're going to start a normal game right now. Content. Right, because I have the pre-order bonus, which is just... Decorations, yep, and deluxe. Notre Dame and Victor Hugo sets. Don't know what that means, but cool. Um, and I'm gonna write down. How do I do this? Over here, I guess. Normal. And and like I only want to do the first few turns at first. So. We'll say, like, turn 50, turn 20, something like that. Um, and this game will set that gold. Because I want to see how much gold I'm making at the turn we choose our first culture. On average. Um, sort of thing. Uh, so let's go ahead. I mean... This is standard... Like, uh, also, this should be a randomized option, but like, and it didn't. Why are there only two normal? And everything else is advanced and expert. It's like, I am not advanced and expert. Why am I playing against advanced and expert Com computer AI? In my mind, that means they're going to kick my ass. Yet losing, and again, anytime you play a new game, don't be afraid to lose. I lost my first few games to Stellaris so on and so forth. I was learning the game. Completely understand. But, it is intimidating. If, if you're a new player and you see that, it's like, well, why can't I play against normal computers? Fuck this. I'm probably never going to get good enough to win. Or, you think, well, if the game's that easy that I can beat advanced computer AI from the get-go, why do I want to play a game that easy? Where do I... That sort of thing. So, I question if the advanced or expert needs anything other than that they get bonuses, like benevolent and vindictive. Um, is there, a, like, alright, hold on. So, advanced, I would assume expert is better than advanced. 
So we got the two normal. We got an advanced. Midas is expert. So let's get rid of Midas. Um, sure. We'll do ancestor. Edgar is expert. Let's get rid of Edgar. Sorry, Edgar. I guess we can keep Victor then. And Midas is expert. So he's out. Um, how about you? You're advanced. Uh, ooh, uh, can we get another female in here? We'll make it even here. Uh, nope, you're expert. Uh, we already got you, so you can't play again. You're expert. Ah, you're advanced. I, I assume that's a G. I apologize if it isn't. So, three females. Three males. We're good to go. Let's do this. So, load this up. It just there there are some decisions I question. Also there needs to there does need to be an ability to change the non-combat animations. Combat uh the non-combat animation speed as well. It's actually not that bad. Like a game of Civ 5 or Civ 6 gets just as laggy, that sort of thing. So like I don't think it's that bad, but there are people complaining online, so you know, what have you and all that. Um. Um. Also, I have no idea how faith works. Because in our... And again, if you're watching this video... I'll probably at least do the first hour of this as a quick little break. I don't know if I'll throw up the rest of the video that I'm recording right now, but we shall see. But only this first hour here. Um, where I just do restart after restart after restart. But, like, I had a Faith Wonder. I guess Boudicca could have had a Faith Wonder. We really didn't explore her territory. Um, but, like... How did her faith crush my faith so easily? I Maybe because I went science? Then it's like, well, wait a minute. If I want to... Like, you can't have faith in science. I, and I understand I went mostly science decisions. But it's like, well, if that hampers my faith so abysmally, what is... So there, there are some mechanics where it's like... What, how does... Because you're coming in with all these preconceived notions from, like, Civ, the Civilization games. Like, this is how faith should work. I build faith things, faith spreads. If we're all even, then, like, my culture's... But her faith just crushed ours. Just, like, I found... I was, like, one of the first people to found a faith. And then the next thing I knew, like, all right, cool, yep. Yep, your city is getting this faith. Yep, yep, yep. That was like five turns, and then five turns after that, I looked, and it was like, your faith is dead. Ooh, why? What? I didn't get any warnings. I didn't get nothing popped up saying, you're losing faith. Here's how you fix that. That sort of thing. A new era. A new epoch. Why your right. tribe looks to you for leadership. We are the looking all those for stuff to grab. What sort of lives will they have? Enter. Ooh, Even those science. who have disappeared may have done something very clever. No. Uh, Sustenance, security, and pleasure. Wonderful stuff. This uh, is this a dead end? Okay, not a total dead end. All right. An event. So, plus two movement speed or another... Uh, right? A new army? Yes, confirm. We want the new army. Hi. Right. You guys get this way. You guys... All right, they can't really... Yeah, you guys head in this direction. You guys keep heading in this direction. Yes? 
We're looking for food. We found coffee. We found coffee. I like coffee. Actually, that's not true. I like tea. My wife loves coffee. Okay, that's going to take a while to get to. Oh, someone found a... Oh, grab this. You. Okay, that one disappeared. That's... Mm, I don't like that. Food, acknowledge. Hey, they're up to level two. Get out of the way. More coffee. Ooh. Lots of coffee here. Oh, good. Grab the food. There we go. You're up to level two. More food, not quite enough. I am digging the position. Um, if we put, oh, what's this? Uh, in the distance, all right. Ooh. Uh, I think we do chase. Aristar unlocked. Nice. So that gives us another tribe to go exploring with. You can grab that. So, ah, we're not the first. Someone got the Harapins. So, Agrarian Empire received more fame. I am a fan of either Babylonians so, more details. So, plus two science per research tech her research technology. So the more tech you research, the more science you get. That's a good one. That one will last you the entire game. We know the Egyptians. Always good. Hittites. Nubians. Alright. Oh, wow. Let's try the Babylonians. So, adopt. Doesn't give fame, but stick it next to a farm. All right. Oh, we have an army to complete movements right down here. Oh, here, grab that. I kind of want the coffee. Um, I'm not sure why I want an outpost. I like the coffee. Plus one food, plus four stability per coffee. On all cities, plus 5% food, plus 10 stability per coffee. Oh, that's the wonders. And there's three right here. And an incense. So... I'm thinking city here, one, two. Maybe city here? Give this copper. We're gonna need that. We have ten faith animal lover. Ah, the challenges of a young civilization. We know so this. This means more than just markets for the Babylonians. It's also the beginning of mathematics, All right. astronomy, and a set of codified laws that I unknown. Shit. All right. So. You, I do want my first city here. See, that's right at the edge. And I, I don't like being at the edge, because then you can't... Ex well, I guess it doesn't matter. You really can't expand in that direction. Although this is, this is kind of a small one. Like, this is 14 and 4. Now, 
19 and 5, 8 and 15, 6 and 11, 10 and 8. But again, there's nowhere to expand to. Okay. Like, there's 8 and 10. Which is which a bit better balance. It gives you some regions to expand to. We're going to want... Oh, well, that's copper. Science. Although with these guys, not having a lot of food is not the worst thing, because we like farmers. No, 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 go back, go back, go back. No, no, shit. Well, I just wasted a turn. Thank you, I gotta hit escape. Yes, sir. See, and that's the thing, though, is like, we only have two cities. Right, if I put one here, I guess I could do here, and it looks like this is connected here, and then here, get this all of this, and out, yeah, sure, I guess that works. So, alright, hold on, let's move you back, one idle army, you explore there, you're exploring there, end the turn. We'll, we'll take a turn or two to poke around. Over this way. Let's go. Come over here. Alright. Um, I want that coffee. And incense and whatever this is. Okay, they're recommending here. We can't, well, I guess. Then we can't build. Here is 1414. 1116. I guess here. I feel like they're much the 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 areas you can grab are much smaller. First one's free. Let's grab it. Arcturus is our first city, and you can keep exploring in this direction. All right, you're big, so you backtrack to here. You go exploring here. We'll end the turn. Someone chose another culture. Let's go. They're headed back here. Oh, this is this is windy. Alright. Alright. So we're grabbing this one. Here and here, maybe it's gonna take a few turns. By building an outpost, see what happens. territory is this easy. The trick, of course, is keeping it. And this will be our first city. Our main thing is science. We need to get that up and running. So let's go ahead and evolve our tourists into a city. We now have food, science, industry, so on and so forth. Cool. We want one of each. 80. I don't mind dropping down to 50. I'm okay with that. You're headed there. You're headed back here. You're headed... No! This way! Oh. Yeah. Instant res. Cool. Alright, and we shoot we take a look at the science. So we start at plus three plus three. So we have found in our first city. So first city. Plus three gold. Enter. God damn it. Um. Three. 
Can I do three plus? Okay, I can do three plus gold. Three plus influence. And our first tech is going to take 11 turns. Okay, that's all I wanted to see. First tech, 11 turns. Done. So this is on normal. Save, and we're going to call this norm XP1. Wrong button. Let me try that again. Norm XP1. There we go. All right, so that is saved. So, switch to main menu. Done. Play. New game. Okay, it is randomized. We didn't have... We, we had... We didn't have Edgar last time. Um... Sure, let's... Do, can we do all women? I mean, we can. No, we can't. Alright, uh, and Elisa's normal, Lucy's normal. Alright, we're good. Alright. Yeah, sure. Uh, game, everything else is the same. We're going to change the pace from normal to fast. And see if anything changes once we found our first city with gold, influence, or how long it takes to get our first tech. Okay? And for the purpose of the experiment, we will have to choose the Babylonians again. Start. Assuming we can be one of the first ones to grab the culture. Um, I would like to start as all of them. I don't know if we need to. That is the problem. Yeah, I just not much I can do. Just be healthy, Fluffy. That's all I've said. I do like the music, yes. Here we go. Skip this. Another day. Another all right. Dawn of human you try. Ooh, it is time to finish breakfast, still. give a rousing speech, and leap into the future. All right. Those are randomized. That's pretty cute. Ah, no, 353, that hasn't changed, I don't think. No, I think it did, right? Isn't it normal 5105? If you learn nothing else, you could learn what killed them. Gonna do this real quick, grab some food. Delicious. Though next time it might be better if you washed it first. Oh yeah, no. Things are definitely sped up. Let's do it. Yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Or I just got lucky. Oh boy, we're we're at the 
bottom of a a, a bed. Ooh, whales! Oh, floating gold from the guts of sperm whales. Ambergris is a perfume aphrodisiac. This is a real thing, by the way. Medicine and more. More stability. That's neat. You you can't fight shit. And crap the science. Oh, you have an event. Sure. Go. You guys head off in this direction. This way. Grab the food. You guys find an outpost down here. Five nine ten. Interesting. Four fifteen. Lacking on food in this area. I don't think you want to go there. Can't be done on a resource deposit because I think you lose out on that. Five nine, not the worst. Let's go ahead and oh, enter a new editor. Choose now. Wow! All right, Babylonians, it is a dock. Confirm. Ah, the challenges of that doesn't so change. This means more than just markets right. for the Babylonians. It's also the beginning of mathematics, astronomy, and a set of codified laws that I wouldn't want to be caught breaking. Off we go. And that way, you become a city. Ah, now this is interesting. So some things have changed. This hasn't changed. Okay. So, this is... Quick, right? So, quick. We still start with first city. Plus, uh, sorry. Three plus influence. Or... No, gold first, sorry. Gold. Three plus influence and how long would it take us to research our first tech aha okay so tech times are affected this is only five turns first tech five turns gotcha so from what we can judge oh i didn't even think to check that plus three science per turn Save. This is quick XP one. Save. Load. Manual. Load. Yeah, it's that Babylonian thing will snowball so fast as far as science goes. Because every tech you get gives you more. At least it's not percentage based. But every tech you get, you get more science. So the Babylonians feels like a very strong first pick. Just want to check something real quick. Okay. So we were getting plus three science on our first turn. Uh, so I, I should add that. Three plus science. Here. Uh, we will be jumping back to normal. Um, right, so if we look at tech. Still plus three science, but look, only eleven. Um, I'll choose that later. So, quit to main menu. Okay. Play new game. Here, why does Agamemnon keep changing? Right. Yeah. So, you can only have one. Sure, we'll do her. Alright. 
So pace. Oh, sorry, that was fast. I apologize. So I assume in Blitz, income doesn't seem to be affected. How long things take does. So we're not going to do Blitz. Because I assume that is halved again. Or reduced even further. We're going to try... Slow. And see where that puts us. I like, though, how it feels like the more you load. Our universe, a new era, a new epoch. While your tribe looks mm -hmm. to you for leadership, the weight of all those future unborn All right, so some requirements do change. What sort of lives will they have? So the, the, the requirements to get out of the ne Neolithic era do change. Full bellies and healthy children. As I does the amount of food needed to level up. Okay, good to know. Um, uh, let's head north. Get a 50-50 shot of picking a good way to go. This way. Even those who have disappeared may have done something very clever. Mm-hmm. What's this? Woodland! Papyrus de deposit! Just... Oh, that's interesting. It just gives plus one to everything. Is it... Wait. Is it a resource? Okay, there we go. Plus four stability. Plus three science. Ooh. Nice. Alright, let's keep going north. We'll go this way. Food. I think there was something there. Right, back this way. We have an event. More refugees. Right, we can explore more. Hey, more food. Ah, science! Ooh, more science! Sanctuary. Okay. There's some mammoths. Okay. Grabbing the science! Ooh, wow, more science! What the? There's a ton of science in this area. This way. That's six. We need 15. Seems like a very big dead end. Damn, dear. Oh! We found a world need. We found Lake Bacall. The largest body of fresh water in the world. And the deepest. Don't drop anything precious. Uh, okay, that got us 50 fame. Understood. Plus one industry. Plus one vision range. Nice. Uh, if you control it, you get plus five in influence. Plus ten stability on the city or outpost. And plus ten money on the city or outpost. That is neat. Go grab that science. Over there. Okay, enter. Oh, we got an event. Uh, on nomadic, on city or outpost. Uh, I prefer the domestication research. I don't know what dom domestication research is. Oh, God damn it, dear. Quiet! Hmm. 
Oh! Interest. Do we want to claim the horses? Hmm. Interesting. If we can claim this territory, right? Because each time you do it, it costs more fame. So I want to see. If this is. I think this is a dead end. Alright. So this could grab here. Right? One. Two. This torque. Mm. Or. Yeah, I don't know if I want to grab this territory. Oh, oh, that's how we do it. This one grabs one, two. This one grabs one. This one grabs one, two. Which means we are settling in here. And in here. Alright, I think that's the goal. We're going back this way. Sixteen six. That's not the worst. Fourteen seven seven eight. Interesting. That give us some science. That's right up against an edge. We don't have a choice except to build to the left. It's a lot of food. It seems to prioritize food over production. Sure, if that's, if that's where it's saying do it, let's do it there. There's, there's got to be a reason, right? Yeah. Oh! You stand at a crossroads. For many months, the tribe has trekked through the wilderness, slowly torturous, learning the secrets of this world. Oh, you know what? We're just trying to... So, we get Legacy. Interesting. One will dub plus industry per population. Plus food per population. Or science. Well, we let's do storytellers. Because we're we're a science. We eventually wanna crank out the science. Someone found Mount Vesuvius? Ooh. Yay you That's an interesting little bit of That. Yeah, see, now we need 30. So your first one's super cheap. Second one's expensive. Four. Oh, cool. We're getting... Now, this is interesting. I want to... We can't cross mountains, so that's kind of... Maybe we do put one in here. And grabs here. Ah. Uh, and then out here somewhere, maybe? Hmm. So that. We have a decision. Plus five food for 15 turns. Yeah, plus two science doesn't help us. Food might. Oh, is it taking seven seven turns to make? Oh, shit.
All right, let's head in this direction. All right, someone beat us to it. Yeah, I didn't realize it wasn't built yet. I didn't realize it would take, oh, 78 turns. This way. Oh, this way. Nice. Alright. Someone beat us to it. Uh Onward. Nope. Uh, oh, bollocks. Gotta be careful about where you click. I guess codify is better. It's gonna take him for oh, there we go grab that. How did the population go up without actually? Okay, sure. Where is that mammoth going? There we go. All right, no one took the Babylonians. A dog. Can't grow it into a city yet? Interesting. Alright. Feel like we're on our own. Can you get away from there? Ah, the Every single This means more than just markets for the Babylonians. Right. It's also the beginning of mathematics. Astronomy and a set of codified laws that I wouldn't want to be caught breaking. Is he chasing us? Well, we don't have a city yet, but it's very obvious. All right, that this is effective. Domestication is literally this. Interesting. Oh, I have to choose a check. Alright, what does this get me? Scout Riders. Sure. Alright, immediately upgrade this to a city. Alright, so... Income is not affected. All right, and we got a bonus to this. But yeah, look, 14 turns versus 11, we'll say. Everything else is the same. Uh, we do have a little bonus, but that might from, from an outside resource. So, the, what speed affects what it takes to do something. But not everything. Um, and increases the amount of science. Probably increases whatever triggers these. Um, good to know. Alright, so this is lo long game, long experiment one. Alright, save. Let's go ahead and load up the normal one again.
They are long, but not as long as they could be. Okay, so we're Babylonians. The other thing... Yeah, Egypt is the strong one because the pyramids build add, add influence. Acknowledge. So, okay. Because that's like an outpost is right now tech. But the moment I put one down, it'll increase. So you're headed there. And we wanted another city in here. Sixty. Ah, because it's connected to here. Gotcha. Interesting. Um. And the first thing we're gonna build, so astronomy house, one plus one food per researcher. Oh, plus one science per researcher. And an extra research slot, or an extra researcher slot, whatever that is. Uh, it can only be built once per territory. It takes a hundred, so they're expensive. So my first inclination is to queue up, literally. Let's take a look at production. We've got woods, we've got water. So we, uh, oh. And we've got coffee right there. So, if we want to build three of these, ideally, we... Mm, two, one, one. I want to give up the food. This feels like good food here, here, and here. That's three, two, two. So, we're only losing one food here and two food here. So we could do one, two, three. Food. Three science? Or something like that. So, build one of these. One of these. And one of these? Sure. Balanced is fine. And we keep you guys exploring. Right. Um, open the tech tree. So what is this? Plus five food per horse. Do we have a horse? We do not have a horse here. We do have a horse here, but that's going to a different city. So we're going to pass on that. Although scout riders are nice. Rainery is nice. Artesian's quarters to grab the coffee. Maybe. Um. Or carpentry. You have a lot of woodlands. Woodland here. River Spring. Woodland there. Let's grab the calendar and see where that puts us. Well, actually, let's go to the tech tree. Four irrigation plus food on rivers for the five. Oh, oh, mountain, stony fields, and rocky fields. Those are pretty important. And then bronze working. So there's our first seven. We'll see how that goes. Incense. Gotcha. Alright. So we plop. Does it doesn't say 
four and fifteen isn't the worst because it'll send some of the production to here, so it'll make up for the lost lack of production there. So I feel that's actually pretty damn good. Uh, we do have groups of three we can build on. Eight and nine's a bit better balanced. Let's build an outpost there. Someone discovered a mer. Yes, you guys can head here. Guys are heading there. All right, now you're heading back. You guys head down here. You're building. That's fine. You're setting an outpost. Have a move. That'll take two turns. Then we grab all of this. Oh! Can we cancel? I guess we didn't want it there. Now we're building a... Well... Yeah, I guess that's not the worst. Alright, fine. End turn. Let's go. Off we go. Yes, go! Grab, 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 grab! And more range, more science, more influence. Beautiful. How much for this outpost? 20. Gotcha. Where would we put it? I guess there. Let's go. It's gonna take a few turns. All right, you're built. How much to connect? 30. All right. Yep, that's fine. Food, at nights even spread. I'm okay with that. Um, leave the sanctuary. I don't want to pillage that one. You're out exploring. Can you head in this direction? I don't know if they can take a mammoth. 26 to 3. Hello, this is Gohan the Chichilla, and we hope you're having a good day, as do I. As always, we hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, feel free to follow, like, subscribe, or comment. Or even better, come on over to twitch.tv backslash sparkytdk and watch me live every Monday through Friday. Thank you for your support.